Deke has some exciting news to share. Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you had an idea. Indeed, Deke does. Uh, Deke knows that you want to learn about all sorts of beasts. And Deke recently heard rumors of a phoenix nest in a nearby mountain. A phoenix nest? I wonder if it belongs to the phoenix Natty mentioned. The one Harlow and the poacher pack are after. Deke would not doubt it. If Deke has heard of it, surely the nasty poachers have as well. Which means it could be in danger. Well, I'd better go and rescue it then, hadn't I? Indeed, think so. So majestic a beast should not fall into such vile hands. Deke is not sure why, but Deke feels that saving a phoenix might help to make amends for what happened with Deke's prior master. Deke hopes that you are able to find the phoenix and bring it to the room where it will be safe. Nice to see you, my young friend. Revelio. Wonder who lives here. Revelio. If anyone ever knew how to keep muggles out, Hello, Hamora. Revelio. Revelio. The beasts are safe. Revelio. What are you up to now? A blockade. What good poachers are already here. Revelio. Incendio. Rebellio. Incendio. Defender. Accio. Defaulto. Rebellio. C 
Could the Phoenix be in there? Incendio. Eight legs is simply too many. Accio! Incendio! Revelio! Revelio. What? No. Keep looking. The window. See how much a single feather. Akio. Imagine sending. Potato. That's stupid. Revelio. Incendio. Akio. The pulse. They want to buy off. Incendio. Incendio. Defender. Protector. Super point. Action. Things can fly, can't they? We keep them people out. Pay attention. The pulse. The incendio. 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 Accio. One less poacher in the wizarding. Revelio. The Phoenix. It almost seems as if it wants me to follow it. I need to find it before the poachers do. Revelio. There it is again. <laughs> uh. 
Incendio. Revelio. Rebellion. Accio. Incendio. Defender. Rebellion. Your poaching days are over. Revelio. Depulsa. Revelio. Get you back to the room. Deeks. Hello. I'm here to help. I can take you somewhere safe. The 
This looks intriguing. Lumos. Incendio. Did you find the phoenix? Yes, Deke. And I rescued it from the poachers. I have it here. It's safe. Remarkable. Well, what are you waiting for? Deke cannot wait to... You keep it close. Professor Weasley and Deke were right to tell you about the Room of Requirement. Look at all you've done, and how many beasts you've rescued. A phoenix is safe now, because of you. I couldn't have done it without your help, Deke. Thank you. Uh, Deke is grateful for the kind words, and also grateful to have been of assistance to someone like yourself. Helping you do such good for so many beasts has given Deke a sense of peace Deke hasn't known in years. Deke will always be here for you when you need him. Deke thinks you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. I don't have anything for this at the moment.
Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. from a catacomb which requires a dark sacrifice. Lumos. I know how it sounds, but if this can help you, it's worth the risk. Does Ominous know about this? He helped find the scriptorium where we discovered Slytherin's spellbook. <sighs> Very well. If Ominous will be there, I'll meet you. We don't have much time. Solomon wants to leave Feldcroft. What? Leave? Never mind. You need to stall him. Buy us time, Anne. Please. I shall do my best. I'll be in touch. Solomon can't take Anne from Feldcroft. Where would they go? When would I see her? Sebastian, don't think I've forgotten about your goblin friend. I haven't. But I appreciate you setting our earlier discussion aside for now. Of course. I can't believe my uncle wants to leave Feldcroft. Anne's going to stall him. She must. We need time. Time? For what? I've learned more about the relic. I cross-reference Slytherin's spellbook with everything in the library on relics and dark sacrifices. That's when I realized something. I believe the relic will only work inside the catacomb. We just need to get Anne to the catacomb and work out how to make a dark sacrifice. Our biggest hurdle may be convincing Ominous. And we'll only give this a chance if he's on board. And we have to keep all of this from your uncle. If he goes to the headmaster, we could be expelled. Let me handle Ominous this time. As for my uncle, he's not an aura anymore. 
What he doesn't know, well, won't hurt us. Good luck with Ominous. Until we meet again. I shall let you know when the four of us should meet at the catacomb. Look for my owl. See you soon. Resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Revelio. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Revelio. Rebellion. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Pardon? Were you calling to me? I was. I'm Marianne Moffat. Pleasure. At the moment, I'm having a great deal of trouble trying to find a particular Derricol. 
Ah, uh, yes, the magical bird can disappear when it senses danger. Peculiar things, aren't they? Did you know that muggles call them dodos? <laughs> Such a funny name. I'm worried about a large albino derecol known as Gwenaira. She's a local legend, so of course poachers are after her. If I had her, I'd treat her like a queen. And I could use her molted feathers as fashion accessories. Sounds as if she needs rescuing. I know the perfect place. The perfect place is with me. Wait until the neighbors see her, not to mention how fashionable I'll be with those beautiful feathers. I can't seem to rescue her, and I'm worried the Derricals don't trust me since I've been hanging about their den. I'll keep an eye out for a large white Derricle. Oh, thank you. Those gorgeous feathers. And she'd be safe. One last thing. She seems to spend her days in hiding. I've only ever seen her at night. I do hope you're able to save her. Be prepared to... Revelio. I sometimes wonder if she actually enjoys the pursuit. Alohomora. I suppose I should watch for Gwenaira. At night, apparently. Revelio. Any luck finding Gwenaira? <laughs> Revelio. right out of a storybook. Rebellion.
This must be the Diracle den that Miss Moffat told me about. Now, where is Gwenaira? Moffat now. Rebellion. Expelliarmus! Incendio! Defendo! Propendo! Descendo! Imperium! Incendio! Defendo! Rusty? Revelio. Wonder who lives here. Oh, hello. Any luck? I... Miss Moffat, I call Gwenaira. That's incredible. Was it terribly difficult? She was difficult to track down, but I managed in the end. Believe me, I know. Well, may I have her now? Actually, I think she'll be safer with me. But it was my idea to rescue her. I'm the one who fell in love with her beautiful plumage. Oh, the cheek. Now, what shall I do? Without her feathers, I can't finish any of my fashion designs. You traitorous I hope you This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Rebellion. 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 Knowing a meat, he's likely studied here. Revelio. <laughs> Nothing pleasant about this coast. 
I received your owl. Thank you. I'm glad you came. I spotted droves of Ranrock's loyalists coming up from the coast. Overheard one of them say they're headed to another cavern, like the one we found. How are they still one step ahead of us? They can't know about the triptych. I don't know. I did see another memory. This time, it was a keeper named Neve Fitzgerald. She was unnerved by Isadora's use of ancient magic. But I still can't be sure how any of it connects to Ranrock. These keepers are playing games with you. You need to press them for more information. It doesn't work like that. To access each of these memories, I have to complete a trial. It's not as easy as you think. They're showing me the memories in a particular order. They... Oh. Either they don't trust you, or you don't care enough about Anne to ask the difficult questions. Of course I care, Sebastian. We've come this far. Don't let your frustration get the better of you. Fine. I'll defer to your keeper friends. For now. But I don't like it. We don't have a choice. Now, shall we see why the triptych led us here? Let's go, quickly before we're spotted. Keep a close eye out. I saw some of Ranrock's crew moving off the path just ahead. I wonder why? Raiding, I imagine. This mountain used to safeguard local hamlet valuables, but it's been abandoned ever since Ranrock took hold of the coast. Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same thing. Nice work. Thestrals uh. uh. overhead. Some consider them a bad omen. Hmm. Not everyone does. I know that. All right. I'm making small talk. I'm not going to trek up this mountain in silence. Rebellion. Incendio. I'm sorry we can both see Thestrals. It's certainly not something I hope we have in common. Rebellion. Kill any of trespass. Wait, we should have some sort of plan. Incendio. <laughs> Thank you. 
Rebellious. What were you thinking? I was thinking about dead goblins. You could have got us killed. But I didn't. Looks like Banrock's loyalists were heading further up the path. Let's keep going. Uh. Incendio! Ramrock's gonna make everyone pay. Anything made from goblin silver belongs to us. Whether it's a sword or a repository, whatever that is. Did you hear that goblin? Ridiculous notions of ownership. <laughs> Fame fate. Nice work. I agree. Only good wizards are dead wizard. Ranrock's got that right. And I'll be most keen to help him achieve his goals in that regard. Defender. Levioso. Expelliarmus. Capulso. Akio, this must be it. Sebastian, wait, wait, for what? Uh, why are you suddenly so cautious? Listen to me. I know you're angry and frustrated, but charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made. Lord Gok said, "Oh, your goblin friend." Stop it. That's enough. Not all goblins are like Ranrock. I am not the enemy. We want the same thing. To find answers. I thought we wanted the same thing. We do. Listen to me. Lord Gok has insights into Ranrock that we don't. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching anywhere connected to each of them. That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me, or I don't see that we can continue together. Fine. Fine. I'm sorry. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. And I have been for a while. I do trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. Good. Ranrock clearly knows more than we thought. We need to be careful and do this right, not just go charging in. We have our work cut out for us. We need to work together if we're going to find the final piece to the triptych. Agreed. Incendio. Revelio. Lumos. Lumos! So far, so good. Charming. Spider. Rebellion. How fitting. Incendio. Defender. Accio. Revelio. Depulsa. Almost as good as you can do it. Accio. Incendio. 
Incendio. Rebellion. Incendium. One nudge in that chest might have fallen. Oh. I think three nudges at least. Revelio. Accio. Incendio. These spiders are determined to make a meal of us. I'm sure we taste better than a goblin dinner. Revelio. Accio. We've read the world of another spider. I shall sleep better tonight. A staircase leading here. Whatever for? I don't think anyone's been here for ages. Rebellion. Incendio. Challenge. Perhaps we should search for runes. We've seen rune symbols like these before. Incendium. Defender. Accio. Incendio. Incendio. Can't get out of here quick enough. Revelio. Sebastian, a journal entry. We should look for more. Why couldn't she have kept all our journal entries in one place?
Nothing like an angry troll to bring friends together. Repair all. That was a piece of work. Rebellion. More than one. Incendium. Revelio. A journal entry. Isadora was here. Wingardium Leviosa. Leviosa. Revelio. I'm out of breath after all of those stairs, but the view, well worth it. Revelio. Another barrier. We can blast through. Revelio. This can't be a dead end. Must be another floor above us. Good news. This journal entry sounds worrisome. Default. Ah, almost as good as if I'd done it myself. Revelio. This place can't have belonged to only Isadora. But the triptych pointed us here. Revelio. Another rune symbol. Fifty-one's <laughs> in runic language by now. Could this be a Revelio? Isadora created. Isadora must have honed her skill with ancient magic here. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. I wish you could see one of her memories. The final canvas piece to the triptych! We've done it! Isadora should not have had to keep all this secret. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. But I don't understand why she seems to have gone to such great lengths to tell her story without their knowledge. I wish you could see one of her memories. So do I. Perhaps completing the triptych will shed more light on Revelio. I do not believe the journey this triptych took us on. This is it. Don't keep me in suspense. Go on, place it. Huh. Another pensive. This is what we've been chasing. I wonder... What is it? Let's find out.
cannot bring my brother back, father. But I can give you peace. Please, have a seat. Isadora, we are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Isadora. his pain. Thank you. That worked? It did indeed. Of course it did. It's goblin silver. I need something much bigger. All right. It would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but if used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this unnerves some. Oh, everyone's ready to wield such power. Perhaps not. Someone will be. <sighs> she took away the pain. I knew it. I knew there was a way to help Anne. Something isn't right, Sebastian. What do you mean? You saw what she did. No, not the memories, the portrait. I, I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't follow. We have seen that view before. The abandoned home in Felgroff, the destroyed painting. It was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. Yes. Yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. But I don't know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The Keepers can teach you. I'm not sure that they would. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain... It's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic. One that should be wielded with great care. If at all. If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. Please, talk to the Keepers. If not for me, then, then for Anne. Why did the Keepers want to keep Isadora quiet? Why destroy her portrait?
Lord Gott is getting himself into more danger than he realizes. I'd better find him. <laughs> 